Well, good morning. Beautiful day in Sydney. Today, a number of things I'm going to do before I actually start painting the uh, damage that I caused on those runs in my last video. What I'm going to do today is um, prepare the uh, dashboard. Uh, I've got still one little switch hole that I need to drill and file out and then that, that'll be followed by a couple of other panels that I need to prepare for painting um, and then I can finish off that wheel well as well. I did manage to find uh, a company that supplies uh, British Standard Fine screws so I'm really pleased about that. They're in another state, South Australia, called Classic Fasteners. So if you need that type of thread that's just no longer available, I suggest you maybe try those. Uh, Classic Fasteners, South Australia. Um, so I got all the uh, British Standard Fine threads that I needed and, and a bunch of UNF type as well to actually um, fix the uh, gearbox to the back of the engine. So I'm getting rid of two big items. That's the engine lifter and the um, engine stand that I had. Uh, they've been taking up room in the garage every night and so I can get rid of those and take them to another shed that, um, that I can show you later on. Um, so let's get started. That's an example of how not to do it, okay? <laughs> The final switch that I need to put in is um, the instrument lighting switch, um, which is this one here. And that goes on the underside of the old panel, as you can see. The holes seem to line up fairly well. So that means that um, these three holes, the elongated holes, are the ones that I've got to try and uh, measure and cut into this. Now, a little bit detailed so and it's hard to get into so I'm just going to mark that out and just show you where I'm going to cut that. Okay so the marking out I'll keep it in the wooden buck uh, for rigidity and remembering it's just aluminium so a nice soft tap with a center punch and I've got one of these and which I can line up really okay I'm using a a sander drill only because um, I don't want to run off and flexible drills have a habit of wanting to run off. Okay. 
So until such time as I get a bit of a decent hole.
the purpose of this video is to prepare for uh, spray painting and as you can see here the wheel well has been rubbed back more and it's now almost ready or it is virtually ready for painting blue and uh, the clear coats again. I've also prepared the um, dashboard which is now ready for its final coats and the gearbox cover plus I've got some other small additional items that uh, I want to paint as well so I guess we'll um, this will be the next video is the final preparation and painting of the um, those items I've just mentioned